Welcome back to a very special episode of the Classic Ooh. Four on Dinger City. To my right is Spencer. Spud, oh. how are you doing? I'm great. How are you, Pop? I'm doing pretty well. And in today's game, we have Gil, who's the Warrior team and is also mm. home and at Yoshi Park, versus Jason, the Donkey Kong team, and who is away. Now, we're pretty far into this Classic. We're filming in weird order, so mm -hmm. we're not going to be talking about the records, but they are on screen, I believe. To the left, to the left, to the left, to the left. The left, the <laughs> left, the left, the left, the left. If it's to the right, I'm going to be... I think it, <laughs> it, might, it might be to the right. Jack! <laughs> oh, goodness Jack, gracious. we need it on the left, please. We need it on the left! Please. You're good, Jack. Yeah. Make a post-it note. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Noki up to bat. Ooh. The three-hitter. Yeah, that's interesting. Right? Um, Three hitter. Does Jason know something I don't? I think not a big baller. Listen, Jason, anytime I see Jason doing in li this, listen, in life, anytime I see Jason doing something, I know there's been thought put behind it. Yeah. Because this man is very calculated. Yes. Very calculated. He's the brain of Dinger City, that boy. I, he's 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 the brain of my b entire body. I don't have um, a brain. I can't even I speak. I can't even speak. That's okay. Yeah, and and we have Donkey Kong pitching. Uh obviously, you know, stars on. DK but star goes off, and DK's a pretty funky pitcher. He is. You know, he has that weird, weird release, and with stars on, he has more curve. Yep. Um, so, my guess is Jason's gonna probably go with Donkey Kong this entire game if he can just kind of limit the runs. But Jason think... likes to do this thing where he, I feel like he'll he'll switch. He'll switch he in will. weird situations. Like if there's like a charge hitter up, and you know he's trying to limit that power, he'll just put a different pitcher in, and yep. it's wacky. And we're going to get the nice jump catch with wow, Noki. Great and play. No that case. chemistry is filthy, by That's the way. Huge. I think we have Nokis in both outfields with double laser. Yep, to we, we have, wait, we have triple laser <laughs> staring at a second shortened pitcher. How right. often do you see that? He, triple laser. Almost never. Yeah. Big bodies on yep. this team. DK as a pitcher is a funky Kong. Funky Kong. Ooh. Wow, what a play. What a filthy play. Top of the second. Spencer. Who's your favorite character next to Waluigi in this game? Like, what's your Ooh. bread and butter next oh, to Walu? Like, Honestly, I, I, I pick him sixth, right? Who you going? Who's who's that guy? Honestly, take away the W, take away the A, the A and give me Luigi. Oh, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Luigi. Uh, oh no, I mean the it it sucks now because like in the net play I've been uh, playing. Okay. I feel like be, you know I blame Balter. I love you, but I hate you um, because he's gotten the extra stock. People actually take him sooner because oh, right. I used to just be like, okay, they're going to take Mario for right field. I suck with Mario. Right. I'll snag Luigi at the end because they're not going to double up on the bros. Right. Um, so it used to be like a really easy comfort pick mm -hmm. because the bat length helps me as a newer player where like I'm, you know, when I'm swinging at that outside pitch, I'm mm -hmm. still making contact. Um, I'm used to his fielding because I play him so much. Mm -hmm. um, so he's definitely just like um, a lot of repetition, a mm -hmm. lot of comfort for me. You know, I, I found it very... Uh... I think this is going to be Piranha Plant. Oh, oh no. wow. The slide avoids it. Wow. Phil. Um, <laughs> it, it was funny. The first meetup we had, which was, I believe, in August of 2021, um, the, the, net, the net players came, and, you know, we were really high on Luigi. Mm. Uh, not as high as ever. Like, he's, he's gone higher now. Right. But we were pretty high on Luigi and PM. And they came... And because pretty much Dinger City yeah. was at the time the meta, right? right? Anything that Dinger City was doing, mm -hmm. people would start to try. But around that time, there were a lot more games to to be played, especially because I believe golf mode had like was maybe one or two months uh, new. Mm. So they were playing a lot more. So they they were they were making their own meta. And after we had already put like PM in our top 13, 14, they came to the meetup and we're we're taking them like you know, as their fifth, sixth, like tenth, mm. right? And they're telling us, I think, I think y'all are like sleeping on PM. Meanwhile, like, <laughs> like eight months prior, they weren't even picking PM, yeah. and we're sitting back, like, listen, yeah. go with it, run with it, baby. Yeah, but like, you, that's that's like calling the, that, 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 you know, that, that that's, I don't, I don't even know what to compare it to, but that's just like right. we started it, and you guys went overboard, and we're fine with it, you know? <laughs> that's gaslighting, bro. Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> You I mean, didn't tell me he's valuable. I, I, I'm the man. I'm the man <laughs> yeah. who, when PM was the 32nd right. ranked character, I said, no, no, I'm sorry. Yep. I, I, I meant to inform y'all that right. he's not a top 20 character. He's yep. a top 10 character. <laughs> yeah. I, I'm the man that said that years yeah. ago. Um, it's mm. just, it's, I, I, I do love that, uh, 
you know, obviously we play here and you see like Toadsworth. Like it's very hard to try to get Toadsworth in, in draft. Yeah. Uh, and then you go online and it's like, oh, you, you can kind of take him because a lot more people like Waluigi, you know? Mm -hmm. And, right, and right, while right. we all value Waluigi, you know, the maybe the people who come here who, who aren't here as, as frequently, you know, Waluigi is like still kind of like a niche pick, right? Because yeah. like you, everyone loves a Toadsworth star and everyone's at this point is just good with him. And that's the thing too. It's like when you're close in skill, Take the characters you're good with. I exactly. always say, take the characters that you are comfortable, you know, you can navigate them in a lineup, right. you can hit with them in a pinch, and um, and I think that's what makes the classic and this so interesting, mm -hmm. right, is that you're starting to go into this territory of, oh, what, what lineup do I make, right, right? right? Like, what's the situation with the star? And we saw your team, I think, over the entire Classic 3, like, we started to see the evolution, right? Yeah. At first it was like, I'm swinging through that match. Where do I put Luigi in my lineup? And then at the end of the season, you had a really good series against Tyler. Thank you. And I think everyone at that point was probably rooting for you just because you're the underdog, right? Right, right. I how wanted you, that how did, you, how did you feel playing this classic, and how do you relate to playing in a season? Because a lot of people mm -hmm. who are just watching, they love both, right? They right. love the classic. They also love the season. How did you feel about the classic, and how do you think it impacts you maybe for the next season that we play? Yeah, playing? no, that's a great question. Uh, I loved the classic so much more than just the regular season. Um, yeah. I think it's no secret that, like, on app, you know, <laughs> except for a few stinkers of games, yeah. which happen, um, I felt on the whole, like, I had a chance every game I walked into, <laughs> which I can't always say when I'm playing, like, top seeds in the regular season of the regular season. Mm -hmm. um, and a big part of that was, like you said, like, comfort picks. Like, right. once I got used to Shy Guy's bat, I was like, okay, I have four of them in a row. Like, I could stack them together and, like, try and string some hits together. Um, once I started realizing the bat limits of length, I was like, okay, like lay off that pitch, even if I have the urge, because worst case scenario, I take a strike, but right. at least I'm not just swinging through and missing it regardless. Mm -hmm. Um, and be and especially the key for me was, I think it just weakened everyone's team and relation. Whereas I'm used to playing in a situation where, okay, everyone's good with PD except me. Right. So I'm either taking a very early dead spot in my lineup just to prevent someone else from hitting mm -hmm. dingers with great him. Great hit. Or I'm risking a home run every time. That right. was a great hit. Yeah. Um, great so, lit off hit by Jason. By yeah, that was, that was absolutely filthy. Man on that's, second that's base. That's the three hitter. Yeah, man, man on second base, we have chemistry. And then I believe we have... Oh, oh no. Play. Oh, that's all. <laughs> all for That not. was such a good placed hit for Jason, too, down mm, the line. Yeah. Oh, goodness gracious. I don't think I've ever seen Boo jump that high. I that think, was a... Yeah, I, 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 I forgot. jumps are... Uh, are buffed in this mode too. For some reason, I'm like, oh, it's King Boo. Then I realized, oh, wait, no, it's not, because Joey is King Boo. Right. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, my God. Jason, can I just say something? Game doesn't like you right now. Yeah. <laughs> don't, don't be liking you, Jason. <laughs> Goodness. You know, and, and, you know, the thing is, too, is obviously I love Mario Baseball mm -hmm. in, in, in all sorts. You know, as upset as I do get sometimes with the game, um, I, I love... The fact of I get to, you know, come here, have fun, right? But what's really fun to see is you got to see every single one of your games. Mm -hmm. We got to see every single one of my games. Right. And it's no secret that, like, we want everyone to watch these games, like what they see, and, and keep the games watchable, mm -hmm. right? So, right. like, a lot of times we're not going to get scheduled in a season game on camera, right. right? Because if we're only filming five or six games for the week on camera... Mm -hmm. It could be a wash, right? Just because when you know that the classic makes games closer, right? But the problem with the season is too is that we did play last season, yeah, and you did beat me, That's and true. it was That's true. not on camera, <laughs> right? And that yeah. is, and we could only talk about it so much on because it was like a conversation, like on almost like you know after that, like, right? We'll spend, like, you know, anything could happen. And speaking of anything that can happen, uh, you could become a member, mm. and you could also what buy segue. some Goodness. merch. Jack, what good product placement there, Jack. Good, good. Yeah. I love Jack. I, I love Jack. And I if you Jack. love Jack, Jack's telling me. What's that, Jack? Right. Right. Jack saying, uh, become an effing member. <laughs> and like I said, buy some merch, singercity.com. Yeah. Uh, link is down in the description. Please do it on your computer because I don't believe you can become a member on mm. your phone as of yet. Uh, but I, I think at 10,000 subscribers, we can. And Mr. Oh, Joe and me's here. What's he saying? I just saw a funny. Someone someone just tweeted at Dinger City and just came through. Oh, wow. uh, it was really funny. Was, was enjoying the new Dinger City video, and then Critnik had the audacity to eat a warm piece of Swiss right out of his pocket. Oh! You've lost a fan, Nick.
You know what? Oh, that's that's so good. That's oh god. We got a second though. Oh no, we don't. No, we don't. Look, look I uh, hot take. I love crit neck. That is rancid. Oh my yeah. goodness. <laughs> Hot piece of Swiss. Hot piece of Swiss. You know what? I don't know. Oh, I, 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 I mean, I'm not one to really have a, a, a real, yeah. you know, opinion on the matter because I eat loose chicken <laughs> from right. my pockets. But yeah, that's gross. Yeah, at least Nick, the chicken Nick, doesn't Nick, get sticky. Nick be thin or gross. Like Swiss cheese is holy. Doing that is unholy, <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. Yeah. Oh. But so this is a one nothing game. Uh, obviously nine innings. Uh, this Long is a character who can tie it with one swing of the bat here. Uh, I gotta say though, I, I'm. I don't want to, you know, talk crap on Gil's lineup. I don't like Toadette behind Petey. Just because mm. I feel like with a character that could also put one out, mm -hmm. you got to give more pitches for Petey to hit. And I right. think when there's a character, which, and granted, everyone can hit home runs. That ball's... That's... I, oh, 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 it made it! Off the top of the wall! Nina pit to Santa Maria. Ooh. Wow. But, you know, a, a character like Toadette who... I'm, I, I've learned to love, in, in at least this format, because everyone can hit one out, she still ha kind of has more difficulty. So I think I'd still put maybe a toad or something, mm. just because if you do walk Petey, um, you're not going to have really... You, you, you can hit one home run and score. Right. Toadette's still more difficult to hit home runs. Mm. So you're um, thinking maybe put Green Toad in there, then Toadette, and then have the Toadette Toad Chem? Maybe not even Toad. Maybe just like another character mm. behind Petey who can be another threat. Because, okay. you know, yeah. obviously... Uh, PD is a character that is polarizing, mm -hmm. and it, it's just so easy to say, I'm just not going to give you a pitch to hit, bat yourself out, right, and then right. only maybe if you fall behind on the count, have to start throwing some strikes. But yeah, I just think a better character behind PD could do skill a little bit good, just because you know you want to be able to get a free base runner. Or if you do get low trads with the PD charge swing, you right. could you know still sink one in, and Tonet really struggles to do that. I think that's all still fair to say. Yes. Um, but we have Kevin Ship at first base here. One, two count. Mm -hmm. Let's see what Jason throws yeah. to him. And oh, he's throwing inside. This could be a Texas Leaguer. Oh, that's it is a Texas oh, no. Leaguer. You said Texas Leaguer. Oh, dead. we had the added second, though. Oh, they the wanted the body check. check. It was oh, bait. It was total bait. It wow. was bait. Jace, the, the brain of Dinger City. Mind games always. He's, he's, listen. Everyone's playing checkers. Jason's playing that chess. And oh, Jason yeah. really loves chess. I think there was a time where... You know, we would have a, you know, we would have a meeting or we'd film mm -hmm. at like six o'clock and I come over like, you know, punctual or punctually early, like at two thirty in the afternoon. Yeah. And I just see Jason playing chess. Yeah. And I, I just see him playing chess and I'm like, what are you doing? And he's like, oh, I'm playing chess. And then I, I mm -hmm. look at the game board and I freak out and I, and I, I go, Jason, I want to learn how to play chess, but I never really want to learn to play chess because right. I, I would be a maniac. I would just keep watching videos and this. <gasps> oh! Oh! That's out of here. That's out of here. Oh! I don't need oh! Him in the <laughs> I like we said we questioned the blue Noki. I, we questioned I can never the, question this guy. I don't question Jason. Yeah. I might ask him a question. I don't question him. Big difference. Yeah. Big difference. Oh, and that too? Nope. Oh, we're oh, jumpies. Unlucky. Yeah, Jason's out here playing chess. He's running the Sicilian defense. Yeah. The Turkish offense. The Portuguese bulwark. I don't even know what Alakine's we're talking about. gun. Are these things? The Australian outback. Wait, are these things? Are they, oh. <laughs> Sicilian is? Okay. <laughs> I feel like in chess, there's so much history that if you just like pick like a nationality and like a nat, like if you mad lib that shit, it probably clicks. 60% chance. Yeah. Well, you know what it's like? It's like when, when you go to the gym or something like that, you know, anytime you put like a different country in like with a workout, it's like, it's <laughs> like Bulgarian split squats. <laughs> Right, like it's it's like why, <laughs> right? Like like Turkish get-ups, <laughs> like I know Russian twists. Yeah, that's right, a real Russian, one. Yeah. And I told I told my uh, my my professor in PT school. I was like, I was, he's like, I was like, well, the Americans don't have anything. And I, yeah. and, uh, I was like, no, we no, we, we have something. I, and he's like, what do you have? I'm like, we have, we have the American bicep curl. That's <laughs> all we course, care about. The beach body. That's all we care about. The American bicep curl. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you could say, like, oh, yeah, I did a couple reps. I did the Hungarian horn tail. And then yeah, like, right, yeah, yeah, exactly. yeah, that sounds right. Like, oh! That's good for the abs. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry, I just convulsed right there. Oh, Baby so Luigi good. made, like, a filthy play, and Noki's about to get bobbled. Oh. All right, I, uh, last round I had Mr. Joe with coughs. I have you with epilepsy. <laughs> it's, uh, you know, <laughs> I don't know what Jason, what affliction he's going to have in round five, but I'm excited yeah. for it. 
Noki just broke her neck into the freaking wall. Yeah. <laughs> that ball I thought was going to hit off the top of the wall and go over again. We have chemistry up here. Ooh. This is a really scary part of the lineup. Mm -hmm. And um, this is a character we, you know, you don't need Ken, but we haven't. Right. O2 count here. I can't imagine. Oh, he got a piece he of got that. A pi oh, that's in the. Oh, wow. It's a plenty blunt. Wow. Oh, no. And now, this is, you said. This this is, is the exact said. scenario we talked about last night. Right, right. The base is open. Yep. Jason usually never, ever, ever uh, uh, pitches. Oh! <laughs> he does it. <laughs> don't, you know what? I, I'm not going to question it. I said and before, I don't And this is classic Jason. <laughs> Seeds the lead. Forcing Gillo to get overconfident so he could strike at the very last minute and take away the potential for a comeback. If anyone, would, I know exactly what yeah, he's doing. If anyone would think that we script our games, we don't. <laughs> <laughs> we, we don't. Yeah. Uh, that was first pitch. <laughs> They'll say you don't need protection if you just hit it out of the park. I'm pretty sure I heard Gil mumble to himself. That's my outside leaf, bro. <laughs> An outside leaf it was. L plus ratio plus outside leaf. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> that was that was a crazy. Uh, oh, I mean, again, off off that star plant. Granted, we don't have yeah, stars, so it doesn't right. really matter. And now uh, we're gonna see Paratrooper get on base with a nice single. Yeah. I, I'm instilling it in the game. It's what's happening. It's, yeah. I don't question Jason. I already said yeah. this. Don't <laughs> keep following the script. Yeah. You're doing great. Donkey Kong up the bat here. One out. We're we're. we're Always charging. Yeah, I think it. you know. This I, power? I, I I I gotta say I like uh, I like Dixie's placement in the lineup because if DK does get on base, she has that extra mm. chem because he's charging. I'm pretty sure every time with Dixie anyway. But that that DK getting on base, yeah. that that charge, we could see more consistent right. home runs, and I like it because DK doesn't need that chemistry. Mm. Now, does the Walu Tech work in a no. situation? Yeah, it does not. Dang. There's no stars. Which is bizarre. You think that it would be, which means it's 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 like was it designed? Was it was it put into the game on purpose? I don't mm. know. Yeah, it wasn't put, which is bizarre, because like, why does it work when there's no stars? Right. But there's no stars now, so it, it's very very weird. It's just like you know, I I know watching the melee doc, they they talk about. Um, it's like someone overnight mm. like decided to make a really good game and just put some crazy stuff in the game, yep. which you would have to figure out. Right. Oh, oh wow. and we're diving. What a slide. And, and when you when you see the inside of this game and you crack mm. it open like a coconut, Ooh. you you oh. start to think, did someone really just put a bunch of cool stuff in right. this game? That makes it a really good competitive mm -hmm. game, and I don't, I don't think we'll ever know unless we actually talk to like a game designer of right. this game, which that would be really hyped to get. That would be sick. Can you imagine? Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, <gasps> oh no, oh, oh no, oh, no, no, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Jason left that ball in the lot, and it got towed. Gil saying plant baby, you know what? And that's been the that's been mm. Gil this entire yeah. small classic has been that plant. Mm -hmm. What that plant do? Mm. And we saw what that one did, and we saw what Petey did. Yep. Blue Noki up to bat here. Love to get on here. Gil, I honestly I thought that ball was a little to his left, Spence. Thought it was a little to his left. I thought so too. Gil says, I thought I was gonna drop it. <laughs> We're charging here with Noki. I like it. Don't need that cam with the uh the, the, home run the Piantas. Already? Goomba pitcher. I, I gotta say, I I'm really liking this Goomba pitcher. Yeah. I I I have seen Gil enough with the Goomba. It's the it's that weird release because you you know the curve in this game. I don't want to say it doesn't matter, mm -hmm. but it it comes in so quickly. Like right. the, the, you know, Boo and, and Diddy and stuff. You're you're trying to milk outside pitches with all that time, all all that movement and and milk weak contact. Right. When the ball comes in so fast, as a hitter, you're pretty much just saying it's gonna be here, it's gonna mm -hmm. be there. You know, we're seeing characters like DK pitch who don't have right. the most curve, but it's a funky delivery, funky release, yeah. and and that's what's generating the weak contact. That's right. what's generating you know the strikeouts. One two count here, Diddy up to bat. Gil would love some insurance mm. runs, and Jason would Won't love to yet. say, "No, no, no, why are you up?" If you're, if you're, if you're Gil, right? Mm. If you're, how are you feeling right now? How are you feeling? I mean, I gotta feel good. Um, mainly because, like, as the home team, even if Jason can mount a comeback, mm -hmm. I'm thinking I still have a chance. So mm -hmm. I'm in the driver's seat. Just gotta pitch well. Mm -hmm. This is the part where I'd say I hold on to my stars, <laughs> but yep. I don't have any. Yep. Um. But yeah, I don't know. I feel like uh, Gil's a very confident player. Yep. Um, he's not like cocky or anything. He just like he knows what to do, mm -hmm. and he's very sure of mm -hmm. what he can and can't do. Right. And I think that's really helpful. And, and Spencer, 
again, we're, we're seeing two outs. Yeah. Three, two count here. Let's see what Jason decides to do. The crowd's on its feet. Meatball. And that mm. was a ball. That was the, that was, fourth, was ball. the fourth ball. That was the fourth ball. No, it was off the plate. I think it was off the yeah. plate. I think it was off the plate. Could be, Gil saying they might have called it. Um, chat, what do you know? Was, was that a strike? Was that a strike? Um, now, this is, this is, what is it? The bottom? Is this the bottom? Top, Top of the ninth. ninth. Top of the ninth. Jason getting, getting his leadoff hitter on here is huge. Tying run is at up to mm. bat. Oh my goodness. I thought we were going to have a boo. Crazy jump there. We're slap hitting. Oh no, you got to get back there. Oh, oh no, no, no! Oh, but he's going to. That's unfortunate. There was but... really nothing you could do there. No. Yeah, you have to swallow that. We're charging here. I, I I like this. I do too. I do. I like this. <gasps> and that ball's in the gap. There's a plant somewhere. Oh, he got oh, it. Go. And this, Spencer, I gotta yep. say, the bat of the game. Yup. Now, oh one count. Now, do you charge here, or do you just try oh, and charge on for DK? I'm charging. Mm. I'm ch absolutely charging. And he's oh, got two a mode count too. here. Oh, that's going to be the game. And that's wow. the game. Gil. Gil taking it. it. Huge win from Mr. Gil. Mm. And Petey Piranha is the MVP. And if you want to be our MVP, the members are on screen right now. We love you guys so very much. Go to DingoCity.com. Buy some freaking merch. Like, comment, subscribe. Smash the bell for notification. Ding, My ding, name is Papa ding. Den. I've been Mr. Joe's Baseball Spud. And uh, Dinger City, City out. out.